Well, my name is Asha and uh, I've been in IT industry for uh, more than a decade now. So I joined IT back in 99 and I worked with a lot of uh, companies, both services and products. Started off my career with uh, Oracle Financial Services, went on to you know a lot of other companies and startups. I quit IT in 2012 and I decided to pursue a lot of my other passions. I'm interested in fine arts and I um, had a fine arts exhibition. Then uh, I write, so I blogged a lot. I wrote for a lot of uh, sustainability magazines and all that. It so happened that it's a chance uh, that I came across analytics. And analytics something uh, is very close to what I was doing earlier because I've been in the business intelligence field uh, throughout my career. So analytics is very closely linked to what I was doing, but yet it was different. So I discovered analytics and I was doing a lot of courses in Coursera, but I also found uh, while Coursera courses were pretty good, but they were, they were getting too academic. And I wanted to get an industry perspective on um, uh, the whole analytics uh, area and domain. So which is why I uh, was looking through several uh, options for pursuing a more structured curriculum. And I discovered Jigsaw, and Jigsaw was one of the market leaders um, in analytics uh, space. So Jigsaw has helped me to steer uh, my career path more in terms of giving that kind of structure and the confidence that, uh, you know, the entire breadth is kind of covered. Uh, otherwise, uh, you know, you have a lot of courses out there on the um, internet, which you can actually study. But at the end of the day, um, the question is how industry specific they are is something that one needs to evaluate. And that way, I think Jigsaw helps in giving a lot of industry focus uh, to the content. And also the fact that it exposes um, a student to most of the um, different streams and uh, you know specialities that are there, which are there as a part of analytics so that you can later use that as a base and build up more on it. So it gives a good foundation uh, Base. So I pursued the Jigsaw course in uh, Data Science with R and uh, the Big Data Specialist course, which gave me a good idea about the breadth of the space and uh, you know what all it entails. And of course, analytics is also an ocean, so you know you have to keep reading, and there are new things happening almost on a daily basis. So uh, I continued my learning uh, and the journey there. And during this time, I joined a startup in the ride-sharing space where I was using analytics more in the explorative uh, manner, where we were trying to uh, understand the customer base in order to figure out how to tweak the product and the marketing strategy. I was also involved in product management. So it becomes a mix of various things. You know, analytics is never in isolation. You get to understand the business. You have to implement those changes as well. So post the ride-sharing startup, I'm now with a firm uh, called Kernel Insights. And uh, we have a price comparison tool called Makichus. Uh, and we also have an apparel discovery uh, product. Changing a career path, you know, after being uh, for a long time in one industry uh, is definitely intimidating for a lot of people. But I would say that uh, if you really want to do it and if you have the passion for uh, you know, what you're setting out and you set yourself up with realistic expectations, then I don't think it's hard. If you expect that um, if you want the entire experience that you've had to be used um, in the next role, that might not always be possible. But it's always possible to come to a um, right mix of what you've done in the past and marry that with uh, the analytics field and see where it can take you. So it's a very individual quest, I would say, to see how you can uh, put these two together.